Hello everyone. In today's video, we are given this interesting exponential equation. x to the power x to the third power is equal to 36. We are to find the value of x. Now before we start, let's note this principle. If you have m to the power m is equal to n to the power n, then you can say that m is equal to n. We're going to apply this property to our problem here. So let's get back to the problem. We have x to the power x to the third power is equal to 36. Now let's go ahead and then raise each side to the third power. Then we're going to apply the power rule that a to the power m or to the power n is the same as a to the power m times n. Now note that you don't have to multiply this three by this one. If you do that, you're going to get it wrong. If we compare what we have here to this part of this equation, you can see that m is equal to x to the third power. Likewise, n is equal to 3. So we're going to have x to the power 3x to the third power is equal to 36 is the same as 6 to the second power then all to the third power. Now you can see that this is of the form m to the power m. To make it clear, let's put them into parentheses. So we're going to have x to the third power or to the power x to the third power. And this is equal to, just like we did before, we're going to multiply this 3 by this 2. So we're going to have 6 to the power 6. And you see that this equation is of the form m to the power m is equal to n to the power m. And if this happens, we can say that m is equal to m. Therefore, we can say that x to the third power here is equal to 6. Then from here, we're going to raise each side of the equation to the power 1 over 3. The reason is that we want this to to cancel this so that we get x is equal to 6 to the power 1 over 3 which could be written as x is equal to the cube root of 6. If you use calculator for this, you get x approximately equal to 